Speech to text in Pro Tools accelerates audio post dialogue editing and music production workflows using AI to analyze audio for speech or lyric information to save hours of time when searching for dialogue and vocal takes. Dialogue and vocals can be selected and edited directly from text, either using the inline transcription lanes or the new transcript window, which can also be used to find words and alternate takes. The Pro Tools Speech to Text Engine is available for Pro Tools Studio and Ultimate and requires a separate installation. You can install from Avid Link by going to Products and clicking on the Pro Tools included apps and plugins. You can also download the installer from your account at avid.com. If you try to use any of the transcription functions in Pro Tools and the engine is not installed, Pro Tools will prompt you to install, which you can do while Pro Tools is running. You can transcribe audio on a clip by clip or whole track basis. To transcribe a clip in the timeline, right click it and choose Transcribe. You can do the same in the clips list. To transcribe all clips in a track, right click the track header and choose Keep Track Transcribed. Clips that are added to this track later will also be transcribed, as will clips that are updated through processing. Before transcribing, you might want to check the transcription settings. Here you can tell the engine which of the over 20 supported languages is being used in the project, or leave it to the default multilingual setting. You can also choose which channels are analysed in multi-channel files, with separate settings for stereo and surround interleaved files and field recorder polywavs. Finally, there's a preference for when pauses are displayed. Transcription is file-based, so transcribing clips that are part of a long file may take a while. Processing occurs in the background and can be managed in the task manager. The speech-to-text engine uses a local AI model. It doesn't upload any data or use your material for training. By default, transcribed text is displayed in line with audio in the timeline. You can hide and show this transcription lane from the view menu. When zoomed out, text in the lane will extend past the clips or get truncated depending on available space. As you zoom in, the text will align with words in the waveform where possible. It even brings it to us. Excellent. There's also a transcript view in the track view selector. This places text on top of the clips and the text will wrap onto multiple lines as you zoom out. In either view, you can make audio selections directly from the transcribed text. Double clicking a word will select it. Excellent. Shift clicking lets you extend a selection to a range. When selecting in the waveform, words will turn green to indicate the cursor position. Fully selected words in a selection will be highlighted. Maybe, but I thought tonight I'd play with this. You can also access transcriptions from the transcript window. The window has two views, timeline and files. Timeline view lists all transcribed dialogue or vocals currently in your tracks, in timeline order. You can customise which columns are viewed and adjust the text size. Each column has its own filter to search and focus your view. You can directly select within clips using the transcript window just like in the transcript lane. The files view shows text for all transcribed files referenced by the session. This view can have a separate column configuration and also features a preview function. Let's look at how the files tab can help to find alternate words or takes. I've marked this line in the track as having an issue. Excellent. Most excellent. The first excellent has some crackle in it. Before we mark this up for ADR, let's see if we can find a better take or alternative. I'll search for the text excellent and you'll see we get a lot of matches. We're getting some duplicates because the word is picked up on all the channels of our location recorder as well as our guide mix. The recorder channels have been named, so I'll filter by the character's name in the channel column. You can see scene and take metadata here from the files. I'll enable auto preview and I can now review any clip just by clicking it. Making a selection will preview Excellent. just those words. Excellent. Excellent. Let's use this one. 
Now I can drop this word straight into the timeline by option clicking or alt clicking on Windows and dragging to the track. I'll adjust the clip gain by eye and let's have a listen. Excellent. Most excellent. Going wrong with Miss. Speech to text also has useful applications in music production, although transcription results may vary depending on vocal performance style. In this session, I've transcribed the main vocal track. This can be useful for editing and navigation, allowing you to make selections based on words. Let's look at some other ideas. I want to add some backing vocals. To mark up the areas for tracking, I've duplicated the lead vocal and left in the sections that I want. Now I can open the transcript windows timeline tab and filter to only show this new track. Next, I'll use the export window contents as file option to create a lyric sheet for session vocalists. I could also use this track for AI generated backing vocals. Let's add Dreamtonic Synthesizer V ARA plugin to the track and focus on this section here. First, I'll use the original vocal to create note information in Synthesizer V. This gives us the melody, but no words. La, 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 la. Next, I'll select the lyrics in the track and copy them. I can add these to the notes in Synthesizer V. Have all day to it all night long. This is pretty close. I just need to shift the words later through this section. Have all day to wait all night. Let's use the AI retake function to get some subtle variations. I have all day to wait all night. Now I'll shift the individual notes to create a harmony. Speech to Text in Pro Tools Studio and Ultima powers new, time saving workflows for TV and film production, podcasts, audiobooks, and music production, letting you quickly search for dialogue and vocal takes. 